afternoon members. Here we are on the 13th of tee. As you can see, there's um, some newly laid uh, Santa Rana cooch. Uh, we're going to change all our tees over to Santa Rana. Uh, this process is going to take three or four years. The club has just um, purchased their own laser level machine. Um, so what we've done here, we've laser leveled this tee uh, with a grade from back to front of about half a percent, which will allow that surface water to flow off the front of the tee. Um, so it's nice and level. Um, this will happen to all our tees. And the reason for changing the turf species over to Santa Rana is purely um, rec divot recovery. Uh, this Santa Rana thatches up a little more um, and then also um, allows better divot recovery um, on all our tees. So um, it'll handle the wear a lot more. We're also going to, as you can see behind here, we've got quite a few trees shading this tee. Not so much today, but when the, in the winter when that, when that sun sets a little bit further in the north, we get a lot of shade issues on this tee. So as per Craig Parry's master plan, some of these trees are going to be selectively removed. Uh, some of them will be trimmed just to allow a bit more sunlight back into this tee. Um, we've also done our, our 21st tee as well. It's been laser leveled and we've put down the Santa Ana Cooch there today. Um, so yeah, things are, things are moving ahead. Obviously with Christmas coming up, uh, there were plans to do the 12th and 15th tees, um, but those tees are obviously going to take a bit more time and we will not be able to get them done before Chrissy due to the, the wet weather we've had recently. So they're going to be done after Christmas, same sort of thing, the laser level taken over them uh, and then, then put the Santa Rana back down. So this tee should be probably back in four to five weeks, um, back in play. Um, so yeah, this is just the process that's going to happen over the next three or four years and the club is going to invest in, in doing all their tees, so levelling them all up and changing the turf species over. Um, the big uh, the big key to this is, is the club having their own laser level machine now, which was purchased this year. Um, that's going to be that's going to be a game changer once again for the club. You know, we don't have to get contractors in. We can do these whenever we want, so we're not relying on contractors to come up and, and do that. The contractors will probably have to come out of Sydney or the Gold Coast. So, um, yep, we've had to all do all this all in-house now, so, yeah, um, good, uh, exciting times.